Good morning. Thank you for clicking on this video. My name is Marley and I do Uber Eats and DoorDash videos in Central Florida, usually around Apopka, Altamont. That's where I'm at today. Today is Tuesday, March 30th, I believe. Let's see. Yeah, Tuesday, March 30th. So we're getting to April. That means it's almost my baby's birthday. I feel like a king. If you guys are new to my channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, like this video, and then let me know that you subscribe down in the comments. Y'all, today has been a pretty, pr pretty, oh my god, pretty. <laughs> I, I swear, I'd be making up my own words. Um, today has been a pretty slow start, which Tuesdays, y'all know if you are a subscriber already, that Tuesdays are my slow days. And today is no different. I didn't get any good rides until after nine o'clock and then I finally got one. Um, I was able to do that. So, mile. And then now I'm doing this one, 2.5 miles for 660. And I'm here at McDonald's already. And it's 9.55. So this is my second order in two hours. And I have the stride app on. I did not forget today. Um, but since I just pulled up, let me go inside and check if this customer's order is ready. All right, that is dropped off. And as I was in the neighborhood dropping that off, they sent me an order. Um, to, uh, they're asking me something. Um, I accepted an order. I didn't realize it was two deliveries because I was trying to pay attention to where I was going. But I saw $9. So I was like, okay. It's 4.8 miles for $9.85. I believe it's two different pickups because it says the first pickup is Chick-fil-A. And then the next pickup is walking distance. So what is it? Tropical smoothie? Oh, Little Greek. Little Greek in the morning? Ken E. And he wants me to ask them to bag it separately, which I don't know how that's going to happen, especially because I'm not there. Um, New message from Ken E. And I'm at a table outside by the Little Greek Cafe when you get here. What? So I'm picking up from Chick-fil-A. And then my pick up... I gotta look at that again. Because now, now I'm confused. Let me look at it and let y'all know. So I guess what is going on now is I'm picking up from Chick-fil-A and then I have a pickup at Little Greek, but the guy says he's at Little Greek sitting outside. So I'm guessing that's going to be my drop off as well as pick up. Um, I don't think I've ever had that happen before. That's a little crazy. Uh, so hopefully it goes smoothly I just don't know how he expects me to ask them to bag it separately when when I get there your food is supposed to be ready I don't know whatever um, but if there everything was on uber so they should see that I was still delivering another order I don't know I don't know but I'm heading to chick-fil-a I'm gonna take y'all down so I can show you all right, Chick-fil-A is right here. Little Greek, right there. So I picked up from Chick-fil-A right here where you can walk to, to the little girl sitting here at Little Greek. And then I was like, you know, I, it's funny because I have another pickup for Little Greek. So I actually have to pick up that person's food before I can actually say that yours is delivered <laughs> so but whatever it's delivered I am going to head to my next delivery now for the little Greek customer which was a salad and she is 3.2 miles away so I am heading there now 
All right, you guys, I just pulled up to Chipotle, so I'm about to head inside for an order. I believe it's getting delivered in the same plaza, probably to like the doctor's office on the other side of the plaza because Chipotle is like up in the front. Um, it's 1.2 miles for $5. I just had to bust a quick UE and they're sending me an add-on right now. Plus $6 for 5.2 miles. That is not on my route. That's way past my route. So I'm going to hit the decline. Y'all, my percent acceptance rate right now is at like 3%. <laughs> It is so low. After I delivered that order um, for the little Greek, I was right by the Walmart where they send all the orders from. So I was declining, declining, declining. I finally just paused it and I'm like, you know what? Let me just pause it because they're sending me all these orders for Walmart and I'm not going to Walmart. Uh, there was one decent one, but then it was four different orders. So I'm like, nah, I can't do it. Can't do it. Mm -mm. Plus it was in-store pickup. So I was like, no. I'm going to pass, um, but since I am here, I'm going to go inside, and it's still early, so hopefully the food will be ready. Alright, you guys, so the order for Chipotle, oops, sorry about that, was not ready, but I didn't have to wait but like two minutes, so that was good. Uh, and now I am, and it was to the same plaza, the doctor's office, like I thought, well, the eye place. And now I'm going to head to Chick-fil-A for an order, 4.3 miles for $7.89. That seems to be like the average order that they're sending me today is like four miles for like $7. So I'm just gonna start taking them and then probably in like an hour, I won't. So I will see, like I'll probably get this one and maybe one more. Are you trying to turn here or what? You're just up in your phone. She's in her phone. That's why she's not paying attention to where the heck she's going. Uh, at around 12, I probably won't take like a four mile for $7. Hopefully at lunchtime, it'll be more busy. So that's good. Um, but right now I think my Uber went up to, and then I just did that DoorDash for $5. But my Uber is at $23 now. So now they're sending me a DoorDash. I should have paused it, but I did not. Well, four miles for $6. So... The Uber that I am doing is better anyway, so that's good. Hey guys, I just got done delivering an Uber order. Let me show y'all since I'm the only person on this little tiny road. It was for $8.58 for Huey Magoo's and their neighbor, woo, their neighbor has a Tesla and a McLaren. I tried to get a picture, but then they closed the garage. <laughs> And now I accepted a double order when I was almost to deliver that for $13 for 4.9 miles. It's a double order. I think it's two separate restaurants. Let me go back to Uber and check it out. Yeah, two separate restaurants. One is for Zoe's Kitchen and one is for Zaza cuban cafe and if they're not in the same plaza i think they're no they're not in the same plaza but they're in the plaza right next to each other so that's not bad too well each in their own plaza but the plazas are next to each other <laughs> so i am heading there now and i am I'm probably only like a mile yeah a mile away from the plaza now so that's not bad you guys i'm super happy that the day is picking up because I was super nervous this morning. All right, you guys, I don't remember if I've done any orders. Let me see. I did, I did that double order for 4.9 miles for 1306. Both orders were ready. I know at um, Zoe's I just had to wait my turn to get help and then, because it wasn't on the shelf, but it was on the counter. And then the Zaza was ready both the drop-offs were easy and then I just did a well I'm doing a double order right now one was Jersey Mike's I've already dropped that off and I'm about to drop off the second one it was an add-on so the first one was 1.8 miles for six dollars and I figured you know what I need gas so that's perfect I'm, that'll bring me a little bit closer then they gave me an add-on, so I took it for 2.5 miles for $7 for Huey's. And I am about to drop that one off now. 
Um, so, so far I'm doing pretty good. I know I'm probably at like 70, $75 maybe. Um, but I am about to pull up to the customer. So I'm going to let you guys go and I'll let you know when I get my next order. All right, you guys, I was able to fill up and now I am heading to McDonald's for an Uber for McDonald's. It's a small one, but once I pick up the McDonald's, I literally have to go to the apartment complex right next to it. So I don't have to go far at all. It's two miles for $5.82. But like I said, and you can see that they live right, right there. They could walk to McDonald's probably quicker than I'm going to be getting it to them. <laughs> but hey, you could pay me the, the $5.82 to go pick it up for you. That's fine with me. All right, you guys, so as I was delivering the McDonald's, they sent me a DoorDash for Jersey Mike's for, I think, like two miles. Yeah, two miles for $7. So I already picked it up, and I am about to deliver it now, right on time, which is good because I feel like I had so much traffic. I need 152 and I am here so I'm going to let you go so I can go drop this off at the door take my picture and be on my way I just accepted an order for Gators Dockside and I was just counting um, all my money up from today and with this order it should put me at almost a hundred so one more order and I will be at my hundred dollar goal and it is about two o'clock. I think they're giving me an add-on. Uh-uh, 1.9 miles for 150? Mm-mm, it's not happening. That is crazy. Um, so decline that. <laughs> and I'm going to head over to Gators Dockside. This one, I don't know if I showed you guys, 2.6 miles for $10 and 39 cents. So that's pretty good, you guys. I think I'll be like, three dollars off for my 200 i mean my hundred dollar goal hundred dollars not two hundred hundred dollars <laughs> got a little carried away there um so that's good that means in the next hour hour and a half um anything after will be Make towards a like turn. my then gas make a right turn on south hunt club so Boulevard. that's good i'm happy about that I was nervous this morning, but it actually turned out pretty good, you guys. Pretty good. Yeah, my calculations are off. That order put me over $100 with the tips and stuff that I'm still waiting on. So that's good. And now they're sending me this order, so I'm going to accept it. Let me screenshot it and accept it. It's 1.3 miles for $6.26 for McDonald's. So I'm going to head next door to McDonald's. Now they're sending me a DoorDash at the same time. 5.4 miles for 375 and that's gonna be a no you guys I don't know if you can see that I'm not good at showing up close stuff I'm gonna decline my acceptance rate had went up to like six or seven percent and it's back down at five percent <laughs> pause orders that way it doesn't get affected anymore and I'm gonna head next door to McDonald's now I just dropped that order off and as I was pulling onto the street to deliver that they sent me another uber for chick-fil-a this time for 3.3 miles let me show you all really quick 3.3 miles for nine dollars so I am heading to chick-fil-a to pick that up now and hmm, I don't know if it's even worth it to keep my DoorDash on because Uber Eats is doing better, but I guess I'll just unpause it and then repause it back. I've been forgetting to do that, and it paused my. Right it ended my dash twice today. <laughs> uh, no, I still have plenty of time. 21 minutes, so I'm gonna leave it. And I'm already pulling into the plaza in like five seconds. Make a right turn, order. then make a left turn. My phone me looks so loud when I don't have it on quiet. Chick-fil-A, here I come. Chick-fil-A, here I come. Thank you guys so much for watching this video this far. If you guys are new here and you haven't subscribed, what are you guys waiting for? Hit the subscribe button. 
like the video too while you're at it that means a lot to me thank you so much for doing that and if you did subscribe let me know down in the comments so i can get you added for the giveaways i did add everybody that has subscribed since my last giveaway video which i know it was a while ago um you know life happened a lot happened i did add everybody to the wheel so if you don't want me to forget you let me know down in the comments and then if you have your subscriptions to public it lets me know that you subscribed so i added you from that as well so i went through all the videos and found everybody that subscribed through that and if you have your subscriptions public i was able to write you down if you do not and you know that your subscriptions are private let me know down in the comments so you can be added to the giveaways at this point, I'm just gonna give you guys my mileage and my totals for the day. Um, my night kind of was a little wonky, so I did a couple more rides. I started around eight this morning and I didn't get a ride till almost 10 o'clock. I did hit my goal around two, I would say. Um, and then I ended up going off the line for probably about a half an hour and then I went online again until about six o'clock and then I came home. So after that Chick-fil-A order for the $9, I got an order for 3.4 miles for Jersey Mike's for $8, dropped that off. And then I took an order for 1.9 miles for McDonald's for $6.84. And then around 5.20, I took an order for Rosati's Pizza for 3.1 miles for $8.25. And y'all, they ordered two orders of fries and two orders of mozzarella sticks no pizza and then i did an order for tijuana which was my last order and i accepted that at 547 it was three miles exactly for eight dollars and then that was my last order so once i think that i finished that a little after six and then i headed home and I had just got home now. It's like, I got home around, I would say like 7.15 maybe, a little bit before that. And now it's 7.30 and I'm just gonna finish out the rest of the video. So for my mileage today, I have 81 miles and I did forget to stop it. Like I forgot to screenshot it before I started heading home. So it does have a little bit of my heading home driving, but it's 89 miles for that. With Uber, I made $101.18 with 13 trips. And that started this morning at 9.32, I took my first order. So that's crazy. I went a whole hour and a half with no order. With DoorDash, I did three separate dashes because I kept forgetting to unpause it. So here they are. I'm just going to put them on the screen. I think they totaled like $49 altogether. So all together, you guys, I made $150.43, which is really good for my day, um, even though I didn't take get my first order till 9.30. And then that one ended up being $16. So that was, I think, my best order of the day. Um, I wanna stop rambling. I hope you guys have a great night. Hope you guys have a great day tomorrow, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. A young boy being may dream. And in the dream... <laughs>